guys, I'm here to talk to you guys about the Apple AirPods Pro and how it has changed my life. So I do have the very first Apple Pods, Apple AirPods <laughs> when they first came out and I do have the Louis Vuitton one as well. Uh, preference wise, my uh, the AirPods Pro versus the first AirPods, there's no contest. The first AirPods the right, for some reason, the right side would never stick into my ear and it was always falling out, so I very rarely used it. However, when I did get the Louis Vuitton one, the Louis Vuitton one had really great noise cancelling, but the battery life wasn't as good as either of the AirPods. So with the new AirPods Pro, this one triumphs over both of them um, as far as battery life, noise cancelling. The Louis Vuitton version had really great noise cancelling, however, I think Apple did it much better. I would definitely recommend it based off of the noise cancelling and the extended battery life. From Honolulu to Las Vegas, it's about a six hour flight and we were there about two hours early. So that one charge battery life lasted throughout the whole flight and me being at the terminal and even some parts after, you know, leaving Las Vegas airport while in the car and all that stuff. Uh, so I'd recommend it based off of those. It does come with two extra pairs of rubber parts for the earbud, and it does come with a Thunderbolt to C cable, but it does not come with the block. So if you do not have the block for it, then that's going to be an extra accessory that you would have to buy. However, you can still use any other Thunderbolt cables with it. It's just it doesn't come with the power block. Overall, I think the AirPods Pro performs much better. I mean, you know, time has come and of course technology is advanced, so of course it should be better. It is much more comfortable in your ear. The noise canceling is fantastic. I heard no children, no slot machines as I was using it. And I also would like to mention that with the very first AirPod, I noticed that the case like would catch dust on the inside and the crevices where this one, when I had thrown it in bags in my pockets, it doesn't catch as much dirt as the first one. I'd highly recommend this, guys. It would be a great Christmas gift for yourself or for others if you are planning on getting it or if you need a new pair of headsets. Now on to the vlog. Bye!
punching out the 12 and 13. Oh, cute. It's more food. It's a croissant and biscuit. How cute. Just so you guys can probably already tell I'm doing this all at once because I won't be home to do it for these days here. So I'm pre filming it. And then it has the, I believe this is the Ravenclaw flag. Oh, great. So I can't wait to build that. And then the Godiva one. Let's see. What did I say we were doing? 12 and 13? How come they're so, they're just so hard to read. So this is 13. Where's 12? That's eight. Um, six, over oh, right here. So this is 12. Oh, cute, it's a chocolate star. And then I said 13 was here. And it is, okay, something must be wrong with these two because they're both empty. So I'm wondering if it shifted over here. Um, that's a possibility. I guess we won't find out until the 24th. And then the Funko Pop. For 12 is, who is it, who is it? Oh, it's Cho Chang. How cute is she though? And then the 13 is, ah, it is the lady giant. Don't you think she should have been bigger? because she's the giant but how cute guys 